but you really gotta pay the cost. Reverse the role that you can play the boss. Already know I'm a, already know I'm a vision is faded. I try to evade it, but can't. I know you far from the same, but I keep lying to me. Cause I've been dying to me, and it felt like I followed you out in the street. And I promise you all that I know. Everywhere that my mind goes, elevated. Heart strong, but my head faded. Way back when we first dated, I'm gone now. Had to go cause I'm on now. When my intuition got me in the mission, we see how to eye, but you ain't in my vision. Oh no. I said, oh no. Back in the day, I used to say, a girl like you, I used to pray for days for. Now I'm out here like way more. What the f would I stay for? Why the f would I pay for? So ain't it's just gonna keep I'm still me, but I'm just better. It's been six months since we touched last, but I grow fast with this letter, and I swear to God that I'm better. What is the first NBA 2K game to involve my own signature dunk package? I would definitely be lying if I said I didn't play as myself the first time I picked it up. You did? Uh, <laughs> you know, I just wanted to see how real it was, you know. I made sure my body was moving the same way and everything, and I mean, the game's the best of the best for a reason. 2K Sports pregame show. And one of the epic nights in the NBA. We welcome you to the all 2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. Welcome to our coverage of the NBA All-Star Game with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg. This is Kevin Harlan. And guys, this really sets up to be an incredible night in terms of excitement from the coaches to the players to us here in the booth. I mean, this is such a fantastic event to be a part of. Mm -hmm. Guys, it really is the greatest All-Star Game in all the sports, in my opinion. We have the best players in the NBA at the peak of their powers. I mean, I can't wait to see what this year's game has in store for us. Now a look at the West All-Stars starting lineup. Anthony Davis is out there with Durant. Then there's DeMarcus Cousins. Then it's Curry. And it's Westbrook in at the two. And fans and celebrities alike have descended on this town for All-Star Week. There's been a bunch of fun events going on all over the place. And, Greg, it's like that every year. I mean, no matter what city is hosting, it becomes a mecca for everyone who wants to take in one of the greatest scenes in all of sports. Not only to watch the best players, but to be seen by the other stars in the crowd. And we've got a collection of the greatest players in the world here. I mean, and playing in an event where they can really let it all hang out. And that's exactly why we always come away with such great memories. I mean, because they really do try to give the fans as many highlights as possible. And they are the best players in the world. And here is Curry following the three-pointer by Kyrie Irving. The 15-footer. And it's Westbrook missing. And sometimes, you know, you don't capitalize off a good shot or a good look. Still, you got to keep letting those good looks fly. Irving dishes to Antetokounmpo. Antetokounmpo can't get that one to fall. On defense, the East All-Stars. Outside Durant. Up top, Cousins. Davis sets a screen. Fires the three. And it's out of bounds. Out of bounds. Last touch by Curry. Let's go now to the sideline and catch up with David Aldridge. Well, I talked with head coach Steve Kerr, and he joked about how he was planning for this game. He took a look at the roster they're playing against and realized there was no chance to take away anyone. That all of these guys can hurt you. He told me if I had to actually try and devise something to keep them from scoring, I might lose my mind. Kevin, back to you. All right, David, thanks. Finished off by Westbrook. And you know Westbrook has an outstanding vertical. And once he gets to the launching pad, rim, beware. Now, here is Irving. And Steph Curry with the foul. 
That is his first foul of the game. Oh man, that's it's close, but you know, didn't get on balance quick enough. Yeah, and as quick as players are at this level in this day and age, I mean, you've got to be perfect in your anticipation to draw the charge. Durant fouled in the act of shooting a three-point play chance coming up. And that's a nice exchange between teammates there. I mean, they really work well together, whether it's all-star week or the regular season. You know, really pretty fresh they get to share this stage together tonight. I mean, they both helped each other to get here, and now they're going to keep helping each other. Right side kicks to Irving. There's the triple. Oh, no good on that one. Now the West All-Stars the other way. To the inside. And that one goes out of bounds. Last touch by Westbrook. No clue where that pass was going. That is a brutal turnover. First quarter of play. We're about three minutes in. Ande Takumbo passes to Irving. The three. A three-pointer is right on target. Irving's got six points. I love the three-point shooting of Irving. Excellent at dialing it in from deep, and you've got to respect his rank. Well, awful defending, really. But in the end, they dodged a bullet. They can't let shooters get clean looks from outside. Onda Takumbo kicks to LeBron. Tries a three, sinks the triple. And I'll tell you what, guys, I think that's the best part of James's game, and he's got a lot of good parts, but his vision is otherworldly. Curry on the wing. Cousins, no one around him. Rebound Giannis under the Kumbo. I guess even he has to miss one of those once in a while. And it's Wall in the corner. Outside Irving. From outside the arc. Tries again. Wall's shot is off. Well, at best, the defense was average. I mean, he must make sure to finish these layups. Got to make those. The putback, great positioning on the putback. Just so resourceful as a player. Davis gets the job done inside in all sorts of ways. And that's one of them right there, crashing the offensive glass, getting that second chance bucket. New players are now for the East. And, you know, the fan voting is what determines the starters in the All-Star game. Then the coaches will decide on the reserves. But either way, whether you're picked by the fans or the coaches, earning the title NBA All-Star, and that's an honor none of these players will ever forget. Al Paul, after the missed three from Goran Dragic, Paul kicks to Harden, jacks up a three. First shot, first pass. He's out of the blocks fast. And no player in the league has done more to earn his spot in this game than he has. I mean, he's having a terrific season. He sure is. Excellence on a consistent basis for him. I mean, he's been their rock all year. And the basket by DeRozan. <laughs> okay, we got a nice little back and forth going here. Yeah, and I like it. I love seeing that. It's a lot of fun when that happens. These teams are going at each other from the outside. Picked by Griffin. Harden kicks to Towns. And counted. And a chance for one more at the free throw line. Pretty much all of their buckets coming from inside the paint now. And a moment here to take a look at the scoring breakdown for the West All-Stars. You guys, right from the start, it's been apparent they're determined to establish a presence in the paint. They've been distributing the ball really well tonight, too. I mean, a decent number of assists so far for them. Here's Krugic. Doesn't go that time. Some solid D from Paul. Outside Leonard. The three from Harden. Score the basket. His second of two attempts. Beautiful stroke on the three ball there. Harden is a lights-out shooter from behind the arc. Harden's gone two for two so far from three. It's Trogic with the drive. Hayward from outside. Empty that time from Leonard. On offense, here are the West All-Stars. They're on an 11-3 run. Over in the corner, Paul. Here's the screen. Picked by Griffin. Back to Harden. From past the arc. And that one is off. And so it's the West All-Stars. Ahead by nine as the quarter comes to a close. Their defensive mindset clearly focused on clapping down on LeBron James, and their game plan is working. Back right after this.
been unfolding. One quarter of basketball already played. And welcome back, everyone, to... And it's the East All-Stars with the ball. They trail by nine points. And, and not as many turnovers as, as we often get in this game. So good to see both teams taking care of the ball. Yeah, it really is. I mean, surprisingly, very well controlled for the most part. Sometimes things get a little wild out there, but not so here. And a chance here presented by Gatorade to see who's on the floor. All fueled up and ready to go for the start of the second quarter. On the court for the West All-Stars. Paul out there with Harton. Then there's Griffin. Then it's Carl Anthony Towns. And it's Leonard in its small forward. And you know the officials not giving their whistles much of a workout here tonight. Very few fouls being called. And most of that, Greg, is because they're not playing full force defense. I mean, you're never going to see as much contact around the bucket in this game as you would ordinarily. Outside Dragic. Pass to DeRozan. Back to Dragic. Shoots the three. Dragic with another miss. A slight advantage for them in the rebound department, but that oftentimes is all it takes. Especially, Greg, when you're scoring the ball at a decent clip the way they have. I mean, they've done exactly what's necessary to take the lead. Singus passes to Dragic. Tries it from 19. Good on that shot, and with that, the West All-Stars lead is cut down to just six points and the bucket from Persingas. Harden kicks to Leonard over Hayward, and Leonard gets it to go on the assist from Harden. Harden's got his third assist on the night. And here are the East All-Stars now. Pass to Perzingis. Oh, and they get in the way of the alley -oop. Not to be. Good play defensively. Here's Harden on the win. And that basket pushes the lead to double digits. And now an 11 point West All Star lead. And the East All Stars call time here. Yeah, he, he's got to make some adjustments here. Just too easy to score in the lane against them right now. Yeah, there's no reason why they should be scoring at will down there easily as they have. I mean, they've got to be more aggressive inside. New players in now for the East. And stolen by Cousins. Here's Durant. Foul call that time on the way up. That'll give him two chances at the free throw line here. And you love Durant's intensity. He has an amazing drive to be an all-time great. Durant hits them both. And the NBA has tinkered with the all-star voting in recent years. Fans no longer get 100% of the save for the starters. Mark, how do you feel about that change? I like it. I mean, again, the fans desire to be involved and should have an opportunity to be engaged in the voting because they're so important to the success and popularity of the league. So I like the fans having a piece of the vote. 100% is far too much, so I think the fact that you've got it weighted between fans and those who follow the league closely, along with coaches, is a, about the right blend to me. Stolen away. Nice job to interrupt the alley-oop attempt there. Lillard with it. He's picked up by Walker. Screen by Cousins. And Lillard kicks to West. Good. Great play by Lillard to set it up. That's seven points for Russell Westbrook. Oh, great ball movement there. Walker dishes to Antetokounmpo. LeBron outside. Right side of screen. Ball passes to Antetokounmpo. Just five to shoot. Shot to stop the run. He's off on that one. Now the West All-Stars the other way. Durant kicks to Davis, and he uses the glass on the way. How about the passing? They are moving the ball without any thought, without any individual agenda. Yeah, and it's really fun to see that kind of unselfishness. Really hard not to appreciate all the assists they've racked up. Yeah, really frustrating right now. They just can't seem to stem the tide here. Yeah, you know, it's one of those days. Sometimes you're the windshield. Sometimes you're the bug. Sometimes it's just not working for you. Dishes to Lillard. In the corner, it's Westbrook. And it's Westbrook again missing. Uh, you know, he's yet to hit another three after nailing one in the first, but I don't think that's going to stop him from shooting. And stolen by Lillard. 
Westbrook. Here we go. And that one, good. Westbrook's got four this quarter. And defensively, guys, they've been unable to shut down the middle. Yeah, and they're really getting pummeled on points in the paint here. Irving's checked in for Kemba Walker. The West All-Stars also with the sub. Curry's checked in for Damian Lillard. A minute 42 left to play here in the second quarter. And Wall kicks to Irving. And good, coming off the assist by Wall. Nine points for Kyrie Irving. Yeah, you know, John Wall is so masterful as a floor general. He's a real maestro out there, terrific at finding the open guy on time and on target. And here we go, fast break. James has got it. One eleven left to play here in the half. To the wing on the left. Cousins dishes to Westbrook. Outside Durant. Davis sets a screen. From the arc. And James pulls it down. Durant's gone one of three on the night. Irving kicks to Honda Takumbo. Shoots a three. DeMarcus Cousins comes up with the rebound. Cousins has got his third rebound tonight. For three, Durant drops in the tray. Durant's got eight points. And that stroke of Durant, effortless. I mean, easily pulling up from the perimeter. Textbook form. Beautiful to watch. White side inside. He's guarded by Cousins. That's the kind of D you need when he's got the ball near the hoop. They were all over. Durant, the pass to Cousins. Outside Curry. The feed to Davis. Over James. Off the left rim and out. And through one half, it hasn't even been close. It's the West All-Stars. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Welcome back to Halftime and our 2K Sports presentation of the All- The West putting on a show in that first half. And that's exactly what the All-Star Game is all about. So much talent on the floor for the Western Conference this year, and they're putting it all to use. The East in danger of getting their... So that'll do it for... to the NBA All-Star Game. One half is in the books, and the... Here is Wall. He hasn't scored yet. That, I'm sure, will change. We've got Andre DeCumbo. Whiteside is out there with LeBron James, and it's Wall, and it's Irving at the one spot. So that's the five in the game for the East All-Stars. Davis sets a screen. Durant, wide open, he fires. Nails the wide open jump shot. He's got 10. And Durant has just such a fluid release. Very efficient shooting the ball from that mid-range. And James throws it down. There you go. I mean, this is the time to get aggressive. I mean, they need to keep feeding him the basketball. Outside Curry. Connects in the foul line jumper. I mean, what can we say about Steph's jumper that hadn't already been said? Irving kicks to Honda Takumbo. Fires it up. No good from Irving. Solid rebound there, and with the score like it is, that's an area where they can't afford to get lazy. Yeah, another column in the stat sheet that hasn't gone in their favor. To climb back, They've got to put forth more effort. Ande Takumbo, and right away, they match it with a three-pointer of their own. Their second half has started quite well. They've been good on three of their first four attempts. Ball against Westbrook. It's all in by the East All-Star. Whiteside's got four rebounds in this game. Stolen by Westbrook. Two minutes gone in this third quarter now. 
Curry on the wing. Floats one, and it's blocked by Whiteside. And Whiteside takes great pride in rejecting shots. Outstanding at getting his arms Start. up and denying shooters. And the East All-Stars call time here. And when you take a look at that shot chart, the amount of misses lately, really unbelievable. Yeah, a lot of blanks there. Can't hit a thing. Has to be deflating. So the West ends up going with the new group. Porzingis with a screen on Hart. That one may be a little beyond his comfort zone, but he made it count. And that's now six points for DeMar DeRozan. Harden against DeRozan. Here's Leonard. Nice spin off the left rim and in. Leonard's got six. Uh, assists like that have typified their effort today. Terrific ball movement. Really a prime example of the difference in how these teams have operated offensively. Much more individual play at the other end. To the left side wing. Paul outside. Oh, Griffin in position. Oh, and they get in the way of the alley-oop. Not to be. Good play defensively. Hayward from outside. The rebound by Gasol. Just a solid performance on the interior. The rebounding has been off the charts. Yeah, you look across the board, it's actually sizing up, shaping up to be a great game. I mean, strong performances throughout, and they've really been strong on the glass. And here are the East All-Stars now. Three-pointer, Hayward. Gasol with the rebound. Here's Leonard. It's good. The assist that time from Harden. Harden's got his fifth assist in this one. Rogic dishes to Hayward. Gets the three-pointer to fall. And his presence as a scorer, it just has a calming effect for the rest of the team. He's a fallback option whenever they need one. And it's Leonard, top of the key. Back to Harden. Kicks it to Griffin. Over Porzingis. Porzingis with the block. And with his limp, Porzingis can be very disruptive on D. Not easy to get the shot off over that huge frame. Rare you'll see him miss such an open look. Over in the corner, Paul. Down low. Puts it up from 12. And he gets that one to go off the front iron. Yeah, the chemistry has been terrific. Really impressed with their offensive execution. You know, the defense, Greg, has really been kept off balance because of the outstanding passes. Four straight field goals have been made off an assist. He feeds it to Leonard. Harden up top. Let's it go. Not going to go that time. So the East All-Stars will take it the other way. Outside, Dragic trains the three-pointer. Dragic has got six. They've given up a lot of three-pointers here today. And their defensive rotations have been non-existent. Picked by Griffin from deep Harden, and the three ball is good. And when they've gone to him, he has come through big time. you got to keep getting him touches. Here's DeRozan. That doesn't go either for DeRozan. They have been board dominant in this game. That's definitely been a factor in crafting this huge lead. And it's been a well-rounded performance. I mean, strong rebounding has certainly been, at the, been at, the, at the center of it, but it's been good on a number of levels. Leonard kicks to Harden. That's good, and it's Leonard with the assist. 14 points for James Harden. You gotta like Harden's aggressiveness, man. I mean, superb at capitalizing off available space when he comes off the screen. Here's the three. The shot, no good. Hayward. And that one is off. And so it's the West All-Stars. Riding high with a 23-point lead heading into the break. They've been giving John Wall all sorts of problems. He still hasn't been able to solve their defense. And we've got more NBA action on 2K Sports coming your way after this break. We've 
been having a great time here, and we hope you have been to the All-Star Game. <laughs> On the court for the West All-Stars, getting the fourth quarter going. We've got DeMarcus Cousins. Davis is out there with Durant. Then there's Stephen Curry. And it's Westbrook in at the two spot. Plenty of daylight on that shot. Curry's got the fourth quarter started here with a bucket for the West All-Stars. James kicks to Whiteside. And he was fouled on the way up. Two free throws now for him. Well, the commissioner recently said the NBA will review, Clark, the one-and-done rule for college players. Any idea how that will change, if it will at all? You know what? I'm not sure, Kevin. Quite honestly, when this rule was instituted about 10 years ago, now 10 or 11 years ago, I thought it would be good. I felt one year of college, if a guy was fully invested in that experience, would be better than no years. But I also understand college is not for everybody. And I'm actually of the mindset now that you should be allowed to leave right out of high school if you so choose. But if you do go to college, I would like there be a rule in place that there's a commitment to two years. I just think that would benefit all involved, the players, the universities, and I think the NBA would get a more mature and an NBA-ready prospect. That being said, I think we're going to end up, you know, kind of where we are right now. I don't know if anything is going to change in the near future. Uh, okay, we got a nice little back and forth going here. Yeah, and I like it. I love seeing that. It's a lot of fun when that happens. These teams are going at each other from the outside. And now, here comes out of the Kumbo, leading the break. Thomas, no good. And low percentage look on that one. Not sure what he was thinking. I agree with you. Not a good shot. Not good offense. They can get a much better look than that. But they're going to need to be patient to do so. Lillard, the pass to Westbrook. Over Walker. Westbrook missing again. Thomas kicks to Anta Tacumbo, and Anta Tacumbo sends it in. Hey, that's why Anta Tacumbo is so feared Lee White. I mean, when he's close to the rim, he's most likely going to flush it on you. Westbrook dishes to Lillard. Clark, we talk about the importance of what a player can do. How important is it for a player to know what they cannot do? Very important. Understanding who you are and what your skill set is and how that fits with your team, critically important. Not only knowing it, but then embracing your role within your particular limitations, skill set, and teamwork. It's out of the combo on the wing. Back to Thomas. From deep. Again, Thomas missing. Alert against Thomas. Now here's Westbrook. He's covered closely. And Lillard kicks to Davis. And so he earns a trip to the line. Officials saw the contact, and he'll shoot two. They get Hassan Whiteside. Davis is really the total package. A mobile, sharp-shooting big guy who can score from everywhere. And so Anthony Davis nails both of them. Impeccable from the line since halftime. No misses yet. You can't do much better than that, guys. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. You know, guys, you've got to give much respect to the length of white size. I mean, he's a hulking seven-footer who takes a lot of pride in being the defensive anchor for this team. He's off on the second. Plus eight in the rebound differential. One more reason why they're in control. Yeah, double-digit advantage on the scoreboard. They've taken the initiative. They've played, I think, with more purpose so far. And it's Anadokounmpo penetrated. And so he draws the foul on the shot. A trip to the line to shoot two. It's on Kevin Durant. You know, when Anadokounmpo puts his head down, it is a really terrifying sight for the defense. When this guy is coming at you, all limbs and arms and size and ball skills. Usually you just end up hacking away at him to stop him from getting to the hoop. And the East All-Stars making a change here. Vucevic just checked in. The West All-Stars also with a sub. Gasol's checked in. And, you know, Kevin, that's what they want, an uncontested look from the perimeter. Sadly, they came up short on that possession. And the East All-Stars making a change here. 
Prozingis has checked in. They've been doing a great job of sharing the ball. And guys, shot A comes to mind for me because right now that offense, it's a smooth operator. Here's Lillard. Lillard again missing. Man, right play, wrong result on that one. Generally, you knock those down. Not much else you can do there. I mean, that's what you want. Too bad they weren't able to finish it off. The pass to Westbrook. Gasol a screen. Westbrook kicks to Durant. It's hauled in by the East All-Stars. And, and you know what? Defensively, both teams have picked it up as we've gotten a little deeper into this game. A little more competitive fire and intensity being shown out there now. Westbrook with it. And recently, the NBA changed it so announcers for teams no longer get a vote in league awards. Not an easy decision for the league to make, Clark. No, it wasn't an easy one, but I can understand that there's always the potential for bias when you're associated with a particular team. But there's also some expertise that you no longer have now because of that rule. So it's a delicate balancing act, and I don't mind at least giving it a shot for the league to do it this way. 119 left in the fourth quarter of this one, and it's Walker penetrating. It's good. Really impressive seeing a guy like Vucevic carve up the defense with his peripheral vision and passing. So good at spotting the open man. Lillard, the pass to Westbrook. Here's the floater. He takes it up and lays it in. Yeah, such a crafty move. That's an all-star game special right there, folks. That certainly isn't any regular season move. I agree with that. I mean, you save that kind of move for the big stage of the all-star week. Here's Vucevic. Some solid defense from Gasol. That's what we're talking about in terms of the activity level defensively. You got to protect the rim. Mm-hmm. Textbook defense all around. Nice job at contesting the shot without fouling. And that's how you do it. Well done. And leaving nothing to chance here on this game clinching run. Exactly. Cold-blooded. Separation solidified. Great effort. Four seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Now Westbrook. Outside Durant. Towns. Offensive rebound. Back to Westbrook. Dish now to Lillard. He kicks to Durant. So no problem for the West All-Stars as they get the win. And it's impossible to know what's going to happen in these games. The talent on both sides is always so strong. But tonight, the West seemed a little more comfortable playing together as a unit, and that's what earned them the win. You mentioned that all broadcast long, and sure enough, it came to fruition. That brings us to the conclusion of our all-star coverage. Thanks, everyone, for tuning in. For Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony, this is Kevin Harlan wishing you all a very good night.